zip channels this section is more relevant for international calling people from here we can do zip channel configuration from the first section we can add the zip server details let's try configuring a zip server you can click on add zip configuration give a register name maybe testing 4 give the server IP address you can skip phone number you can skip the secret as well port 5060 which is preferred dialing code prefix which is not required to mention DTMF you can select it from the drop down RFC 2833 and primary codex you can select it G711 in case if you have purchased the commercial G729 codex you can select it from here secondary codex you can put it as G711 select interface you can put it as ETH1 or ETH0 based on to which ethernet port your bandwidth line is connected and allocate the bandwidth let's take if it is a 4 mbps line you can select it as 4096 kbps no need to mention unit cost per minute so if you know the provider name you can set it here in case if it's an inbound process and if it has multiple DIDs you can take this box however if authentication is required you can take it Cisco gateway if your gateway is a Cisco system you can take it and you can save it we can see testing for server has been configured now in case after configuring it if you want to change the DTMF you can do it from here you can select the DTMF and click on save similar with the codex if you want to change the codex click on change codex and select the codex that you want to use and click on save 